What's up guys, it's Cause Gaming, and welcome back to another video. Today we're starting a new horror let's play, none other than the classic Outlast as well as the Whistleblower DLC when we get to that, but hope everyone's having a good day, and uh, if you aren't, feel free to chill out with me for the next few uh, minutes or so. But yeah guys, this is a great game. Uh, I'm not gonna be reading every goddamn piece of intel though. I don't have the energy for that, but I'm sitting in a dark room. I'm ready to get scared. Let's go for it. Oh yeah, trigger warning to anyone out there. Um, it's gonna get rough, but if you've never played Outlast, uh, here's a little description. Essentially, you're an investigator reporter, uh, reporter and you're just you're trying to find interesting stories, but you end up in an asylum and shit goes wrong. So, here we go. Pretty excited for this one. Not gonna lie. This is a, a classic. Um, and that's about as simple as it goes. I remember when I first played this game. I was very young. And it, it was very scary. I think I watched a Let's Play probably first. But it, it's still always scary when you're playing something like this alone. But here we are. And... Our van. Well, not yet. There we go. Gonna do myself a favor real quick. Can I not turn off vibration? Hello? You know what? Never mind. I'm not gonna do anything. Mount Massive Asylum. What a weird name. I feel like we're rolling up to Bruce Wayne's house. The Wayner. The Wayne's family castle. Okay, here we go. All right, well, we're here to expose any and everything. I'm ready. So does anybody know where... No, I don't think anyone know. No one knows we're going in here. Hence, sneaking in. It's very beautiful, though. Okay. We got our notes and documents. Um, we got to figure out this real quick. Okay. Gonna have to get used to the controls again, it would seem. So it's been shut down. Reopened in 2009. Alright, well, let's find out. You know it's not normal when there's military vehicle. Oh. Alright, let's just get into this. We're gonna say this was originally a PC game. This 
game is very scary because the combat is not combat. It's run. It's run or die. I, there should be a jump scare with TV static in a second here. Should be this room. Okay. Things, things are going to get interesting. I just care about batteries, though, personally. So, so that's how you reload the batteries. The lore of this game, I'm sure it's more than great. Record it. Now there's no way for us to see our recordings, but that does happen in the next game. Okay. Purposely didn't say anything about that because I wanted it to scare the hell out of whoever has not seen this game before. Look at all of that. It's really incredible. Wow, okay. Let's put away our camera recorder. We have our best friend right there. And here he is. I'm in trouble because I only remember, you know, I don't remember all the jump scares in this game, just the beginning ones because, you know, it's so iconic for an intro. Okay. Isn't there... There's not... Okay. It's time to go and explore, friends. We're looking for... Anything of use. I forgot about peeking. Oh, God. This guy is not going to do anything the first time around. However, that will change. I gotta stop spoiling things. I'm sorry. We got our key card though. Here we go.
Uh, I can't see. Hello? We're fine. I think one of these would help, ho hopefully have a battery in it. No, nah, just a lot of death. However, now we're talking. How does he know how to do this? He's a smart boy. Spooky man. Yeah, no, this game is just really sick, twisted, and insane. There's like no redeeming quality to the story here. It's just very, very violent and very, very crazy. Oh, Jesus! This wasn't supposed to happen. What am I supposed to do? So that's not supposed to happen, fun fact. Don't know where he's at. All right, we need to make our way to the basement. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I hate this. Yeah, yeah, no. Um, we're we're gonna run. We're gonna run to the basement. I'm an idiot. We're okay now. He can't get us. This is the nice thing about this game. Your health heals. Alright. Things are gonna get interesting now, okay? Please don't be in here. Maybe they spawn in once. Okay. Let's just hide real quick, yeah? We 
We've got a battery over there and I'm taking it. There he was. Oh my gosh. I will take a battery on any day. Let's do this real quick. We can put away the camera. We'll be able to hear him. Here he comes. All right, he's in the room. Sixteen minutes in, and we're already in the the beef of the game. He went. I hate this. We hit two buttons. Are we supposed to hit it and then... Alright, let's... Not get decked in the face. Okay, so I think he turns them off. I think we need to go for it. Like, just full send it. It's something about gas pumps. Because I feel like we've definitely done what we sh needed. Anyway, we're going. Yeah, we've definitely done what we needed on this. Batteries. Oh, okay. All right, we're all right. So this is what I was talking about. Oh boy.
The switch looks important. We're gonna wait it out. Okay. Here we go again. And then I think there's another room with another breaker. And then we'll be able to hit the button, turn on power. All right, let's go for it. Very nervous. What's the point of that room? Why is this here? We'll take some batteries. Is there anything in here? I hope we can do this now. Oh, that's the wrong button. We know that we need to squeeze through a crack in the wall, right? Am I even in the right area? It's the Outlast experience, baby. We're okay. I mean, we're not okay because I'm lost. But maybe now we can try and go somewhere. Could you vault? I didn't even know the guy was still here, to be honest with you. We're fine. We're not fine. Is it this way, perhaps? I'm lost.
Oh yeah, this is a very dark game. Shall we try this again, guys? He's gone. I uh, this has happened to me before. I I think literally th this. It, it's annoying, honestly. Here we go. Okay, that worked out. Look how rusty it is. Accept the gospel, boys. Holy shit. Whoa. I like that. Ah, oh, that is very bright. Okay, he left them his camera. Well, guys, that is uh, that's gonna take us to the end of our first part. I'm pretty excited for this one. Um, I was raised for. Yeah, I should probably record things, but yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the first part of this video, and I will see y'all in the next one. Take care.